ceremonial raising of the World Championship flag. Doing the honor of hoisting the flag tonight, team president and general manager, Alex Anthopoulos. Well, Charlie Morton takes the bound. He had a terrific spring for the Braves. Longtime Major League veteran. This is his opening day, game two. Wow, perfect pitch from Morton. Paints a corner, and Naquin can't believe it. Hunter Wendelstead rings him up. First strikeout for Charlie, two outs. 2-2 two -two pitch. Check swing, he definitely went. That's strike three. Went right back to the curveball. And a totally fooled fam. And a really good start for Charlie Morton with a couple of strikeouts. One down here in the inning, here's Matt Olson. Swing and a liner to right field. There's the first hit of the night. And Matt Olson's first hit is a brave. A clean single into right field. And that'll make you feel right at home. Yeah, something we hope we're saying a lot this year. That's back to back walks to begin the second. Braves had two men on base with one down in the first inning, hit into a double play. But here in the second, two men on base, no one out for Travis Darno. On the ground, off the glove of Mustakas. Everybody's safe. Chugging around is Duvall. He's going to score. Rosario to third, and the Braves take the lead, 1 0. The ball was wrapped right down the third baseline, and Mustakas was kind of playing off the bag. I don't know what they're going to give it, but I. With how far he's got to go right there, Chip, even if he gets that ball, he's not getting the out at third base. I don't think he throws him out. I think that's a base hit. And away ball four. That'll load him up with no one out for Orlando Arcia. Fly ball center. That ought to score a run. Senzel drifts in. He's under it. There's the catch. They'll concede the run as the throw is cut off at shortstop. Arcia did his job, put it in play, and the Braves add on. Now Charlie Morton has gone six up and six down goes to work on Mike Mostakas. 3 2 from Charlie check swing he went strike three throw that one around the horn got him with a fastball he can still bring it sure can 97 one down here in the top of the third inning one two pitch right there a called third strike wow bring it Charlie fourth strike out for Charlie Morton that will bring Jack, uh, Jake Fraley up to the plate hit high in the air shallow left center field Dansby out Marcel in and Ozuna makes a basket catch out in shallow left center down they go one two three nine up and nine down for Charlie Morton so here come the Braves again back to back base runners first and second nobody out for Adam Duvall a former Cincinnati Red and Duvall cracks one to deep right back goes Fraley to the running track up. That ball bounces high off the bricks. Streaking around third is Riley. He will score. Duvall with a double off the wall. And the Braves extend the lead. We said at some point someone was going to deliver a big hit. And here it's runners at second and third. One out. Infield comes in. Darno looking for another RBI. And a line drive into center. That's down for a base hit. Ozuna scores. Duvall around third. Here comes the throw to the plate. Too high. Stevenson's ready to second. Too high. RBI hit for Darno and the Braves extend the lead. Two hits, three RBIs, Jeff, for the Braves catcher. Well, what a beautiful piece of hit. Waiting for that fastball. He gets it, and, I mean, hits it right back up the middle. Six walks in the game. We're only in the third inning. Brings up Orlando Arcia. He drove in a run with a sack fly back in the second inning. And that's poked inside the bag at first. Good piece of hitting for Arcia. Darno will come home and score. Streaking to third is Dansby, and the Braves are line to line. To the lead. It's six to nothing. It's the third inning, and Ozzy's the only guy in the lineup who hasn't been on base. That ball's poked into the shift, and that's shoveled to second for one. And Ozzy beat the wrap. Another run is in. Early Morton, who has retired all 12 Reds he's faced. And Joey Votto spoils the perfect game with the first pitch swing. If there's one guy that was going to do it, it was going to be him. Second and third, one out. Moustakis to right center. Should be deep enough. Auto tags. And the Reds on the board. Sack fly RBI. 7 to 1. And so the bases are loaded. That's not what Minter had in mind. Fraley at third, Pham at second, Votto at first. Bases loaded without benefit of a hit in the inning. Now you go back to the right handed hitting Tyler Stevenson. Grounded, takes a kick in the left. Fraley scores, Pham scores, Votto up to second, Tyler Stevenson's on, and the Reds get a couple of runs in. 11 years in the big leagues, all with the Dodgers. 
And on to pitch and making his Braves debut is 34 year old Kenley Jansen. And the Reds aren't going quietly here in the ninth. The walk and a single brings up Nick Senzel. 0 2 on the way, swung on, missed, strike three. Elevated a cutter. And that's Kenley Jansen's first strikeout in the Braves uniform. And now we're a strike away. Ready for the Braves to even their record. Moustakis goes. And against the grain of the shift, that bounds in the right. Bottle scores, Moustakis first to third, and Farmer extends this game. It's 7 4. The tying run comes to the plate. Fraley to left field. Two run single. The first base hit for Jake Fraley as a red drives in a pair. Moustakis and Farmer across. It is a one run game. The debut for Kenley Jansen hasn't gone the way he had hoped. Jansen versus India, who's 0 for 4 in the game. Hit in the air to center field. Adam Duvall over to his left. He is under it. He has got it, and the Braves are a winner for the first time in 2022. Kenley Jansen finds that elusive third out. The Braves hold on and win it by a final score of 7-6. to six.